of the bug was pyrite. Okay. And then it had little quartz sprays and big barrets. Oh, wow. Yeah. How big were the barrets, Bob? Uh, five inches. Oh, nice. And they're, they're white like all the barrets here, but they're nicely zoned with clear zones. Okay, and, and they had the nice shape, the diamond yeah. look shape. Yep. yep, okay. Fantastic. And uh, so, you know, you can see how many bugs we found between here and the fault over there. It's not my fault. But yeah, it's not your fault, but it is your fault. It is my fault. It is, yep. it is the spruce fault. <laughs> yep. So now, the uh, this is the spruce behind us? Yeah. So this is... So that's this, old growth? This is all 15. So this is all spruce 15 and spruce 16 is down there. The dividing line is just about where it goes from wet dirt to dry dirt in the canyon. Okay. So the, the claims lay in here this way. Okay. Must be fun putting them. You you redo the claim markers um, when you before not, it was patented. Yeah, yep. Okay. Yep. Oh yeah. man, that must have. We been. had to refresh them. I mean, they were done in 1952 by Kennecott. So, okay. You know, uh, right. Yeah. But you had to get up there and re so uh, redo the corners. And redo them and document them for the BLM. Right. That was not my favorite week of no. mining up here. You know, but no, you got to do what you got to do. Nothing like laying out claim corners. Oh, you know, yeah. especially in this type oh, of terrain. I mean, so one of them is up there. I was going to say, if they're laying like <laughs> yeah, this, exactly. yeah, that's yep. the first thing I so, thought yeah. was, oh, so fun. It takes all day to walk from that claim corner 1,200 feet to that claim corner. Yep. So up, down, all yeah. around. And actually on the lower one, to, to walk across there below the cabin, yep. from so the south line of this claim, you have to stay overnight. You have to camp, because you can't get from one to the other that's going amazing. that way in a day. Just to lay the claim just corners, right. yeah, just which keeps the claim 12, legal. 1,200 feet. You right. Know, but, yep. Yep. It takes two days to hike it. That's the terrain we're in here. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little vertical. Oof. A little. Yeah. So we're sitting right on the edge of the breccia here. So you can see crystal pockets directly above mm -hmm. you. Yep. And then slightly behind you, it just goes into hardened, hungry granodiorite. And there it is. Out you go. Right next to the uh, fence post hole. And you can drill all you want and blast all you want. Yeah, and, you're, and you're not going to find nothing over there. You're probably not going to have any fun. And actually, this looks just like it looked the first time I got the spruce, which was... Right here? Yeah, yep. two years before Sandy came out and, okay. and got involved. And there were just little ferns sticking out of every okay. every hole in the hillside. So obviously it said, gee, there's something here, you know, maybe... Something's you going here. on, yep. right. yeah. So the first piece I collected, um, so I was a... I was a grad student at the UW at the time, and I would have collected a piece up there somewhere. I don't exactly know where. It's not like I memorialized the Right, whole, right, right. Know. Yeah, there's a little shrine, there's, like you know, a Sherpa sort of, shrine. Right, so there's just a little, little hole in the wall, and I take my hammer and chisel, and I knock off a little plate, and it falls in my hand, and I turn it over, and it's a perched pyrite. It's a one-inch pyrite sitting on top of a quartz plate. Are you kidding me? I'm not. I was very just hiked up here. Yep. Just hiked up here. You know, I had... I had an S-wing hammer and one chisel. Yep. And the only reason I came up is that I was working with the guys in the mining camp, and I was writing a paper on breccia formation. Okay. And they had told me that on this side of the valley there were bigger breccias than on the other side. I should come up and photograph them from my paper. And back when you're young, you can right. just zip That's right up right. here. Yeah, it's, it's no, no big deal. So I hiked up, I collect this little bug. Nice piece falls in my hand. I'm like, wow, that's pretty cool. Okay, wrap it up, put it in my pack, go back down, talk to the guys who sent me up here, brought them a case of beer to camp with, you know, for the next weekend. Sure. And, it's all about the beer, the Rainier Hale. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah. 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 The green death. Yeah, yeah. the green death. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.